Good evening. Today is Thursday, August 20th, 2020. And I'll call this Fairfield City School District regular Board of Education meeting to order. Mrs. Lane, will you call the roll, please? Mr. Begley? Here. Mr. Birding? Present. Mrs. Gundrum? Here. Mrs. O'Neill? Here. Mrs. Shorter? Here. Uh, would you all please rise and join me in the Pledge of Allegiance? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Okay, the uh, first item on our agenda is communication. And uh, this is the portion of the meeting where you, the residents of Fairfield City School District, are invited to share your thoughts with the board. Please know that this time has been set aside for the board to listen to you. Your comments are valued and will be taken into careful consideration. The board will not engage in dialogue at this time. Presentations are limited to five minutes each, and Mr. Penny will be our timekeeper. And when you come to the podium, please uh, state your name for the record. First person signed up is Angel Stickler. Angel Stickler. Um, so uh, I know that you're all aware of me. Um, I spoke at the last meeting, um, the one that you decided to cut the majority of my questions out of when you uploaded the segment of videos. Um, and you, you continue to fail to meet your mission statement of parent involvement um, and your lack of communication is really, really, I don't even have words for it. However, I do have words for what has happened since um, and what your lack of communication has caused. I now have to, I've had to retain a lawyer in the, in the middle of a pandemic um, because your sports waiver is making parents sign away their educational rights. What, like, nobody wanted to talk to me. Now you're going to have to rewrite your, your whole, and you're going to have to do it for every student. I'm, like, I'm not stopping. Your final forms, online uh, registration, the violation of HIPAA and FERPA on my end. When I logged in, I had my husband's ex was receiving all of my kids' stuff. She has no right to my kids' information. Here's the thing. I'm a very understanding person, as evidenced by the, the nice IEP meeting that I had yesterday. I can work together with anybody. However, when... Like, I've been silenced and ignored, and I have valid, valid concerns. So now I'm not going to stop. Um, the next thing is I have kids with ADHD on a 504 plan. Now that the school has decided to change the setting of the school, um, you guys are going to have a lot of parents who are going to be requesting IEPs for their kids under other health impairments because their ADHD directly impacts their ability to learn in the school setting. Like, I, you know, and when I'm done, by the time I'm done, like, you guys are going to understand parent involvement. This isn't parent involvement. None of you can speak back to me. How is that parent involvement? And you don't listen. And you lie. You said you would answer every single question that wasn't answered at the last meeting. Who contacted me back? Kathy Gilbert. She addressed one of my questions. So I then had to um, contact the Ohio State Control Board just to make sure that you're not misappropriating funds. Like, it, it is ridiculous how you sit and you, you say, oh, we want parent involvement. We, no, no, you don't. You don't listen to parents. 
I feel sorry for these kids. And that's all I have to say. Okay, thank you very much for your comments. Next person on the list is Connor Shiring. Okay, did I pronounce that correctly? Shearing. Shearing, thank yes. you, I apologize. Connor Shearing. Okay, so I'm gonna speak on behalf of students for Fairfield. In March, when we had to do the online schooling, it was not good, it was terrible. But I get it, I mean, it can't, the pandemic took us out of nowhere. We didn't have time to prepare for it. But online schooling at home for me, I have ADHD, so it's going to be very hard. I've got younger brothers at home, ton of distractions. It was, it's not gonna be easy. All I ask is that you consider five days a week for school, if you could find it in your hearts. Just a short and simple speech, I'm done. Thank you for listening. Uh, thank you very much for your comments. Okay, there's no one else that signed up this evening, so... Um